Weekend at Camden Market. To get to Camden Town, take the underground Metro Northern Line to Camden High Street Station. Things to do here is shopping, food and drink, live music and theater. Over the weekend Camden Market is bustling with people and it is very lively. It has a lot of stores selling souvenirs, crafts, books, clothing and jewelry. Camden Lock Market has a range of cheap and tasty foods. Here, you can take a boat trip by the Regent's Canal towpath. To get to Buckingham Palace you can either walk from Hyde Park Corner Underground Metro to Wellington Arch through Constitutional Hill, or from Trafalgar Square to Admiralty Arch through the Mall. Buckingham Palace was built in 1703 for the Duke of Buckingham. Parts of Buckingham Palace are now open to the public from July to September including the Queen's Gallery and Gardens. You can buy Buckingham Palace online admission ticket at Royal Collection Trust website at rct.uk for £32 adult. The ticket link is in the description of this video. I have chosen to walk to Buckingham Palace from Wellington Arch through Constitutional Hill. The Victoria Memorial is a monument to Queen Victoria, sculptured by Sir Thomas Brock and unveiled on May 16, 1911 and completed in 1924. The Angel of Victory statue on top of the Victoria Memorial is made of bronze and covered in gold leaf. If you like to see more contents, please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Buckingham Palace has 775 room and it's been the official London residence for all reigning monarch. Some others facts, it has 19 grand state rooms for events, 52 royal and guest bedrooms, 78 bathrooms, 188 staff bedrooms, and 92 offices for the king, royal family, and staff. Appraiser estimates that Buckingham Palace has a value of roughly 3.9 billion pounds. The changing of the guard are usually scheduled at 11 in the morning for 45 minutes. However, it may not be on daily basis. It is free to attend. You need to be there early to avoid the crowd. During the changing of the guard please don't stand or try to cross the road in front of the guards as they will not stop or deviate from their line of march. The Buckingham Palace Gardens also referred to as the Royal Gardens, covering an area of approximately 40 acres are a vast maintained landscape located at the rear of the palace. Queen Victoria Memorial has four bronze sculptures, two facing the malls are progress represented by a semi-naked youth holding a torch and peace represented by a draped female figure holding an olive branch, while the other two facing the palace are agriculture represented by a female figure in peasant costume, and manufacture represented by a bearded smith in leather apron. St. James Park a 23-hectare or 57-acre urban park at the mall next to Buckingham Palace is a fantastic park to walk around and explore. It features two islands, West Island and Duck Island. The lakes are a wildlife sanctuary for ducks, geese, swans and pelicans. The colony of pelicans were donated by a Russian ambassador to Charles II in 1664. There is the Blue Bridge, the Swire Fountain to the north of Duck Island and Duck Island Cottage. It also has a children's playground. The park is open daily from 5 in the morning until midnight. Do not forget to enter Diana Princess of Wales Memorial Walk at the park. Depending where you exit the park, at the very end of the mall is the Admiralty Arch. You should explore and discover this vast park to truly appreciate the serene and peaceful surroundings.